B2B Cambodia, the portal for business news in Cambodia. This is B2B Cambodia's Darshana. Thanks for watching. Today we'll be speaking with two guests, Ms. Vichy Kachuk, Chief Executive at ISF Cambodia, and Mr. Anthony Galliano, Group CEO of Cambodian Investment Management and Vice President of AmCham Cambodia. ISF Cambodia is an NGO based in Phnom Penh that has been helping some of the most disadvantaged children and communities in the country since 2006. Mr. Galliano was recently appointed as Brand Ambassador of ISF Cambodia, so today we'll be speaking with him and Ms. Vicheka about what this will mean for the organization. Welcome to the B2B Cambodia studio. It's a pleasure to have you both with us here today. My first question is for Ms. Vicheka Chuop. Could you tell us a little bit about ISF Cambodia as well as the support programs that you run? So, so ISF started in 2006. Uh, we run three main programs, education, uh, football, and community support. So education, we work with uh, children who come from very poor background, never been to school or drop out of school. So at the moment, uh, we work with more than a thousand children, uh, support them through kind of from grade one uh, until get into a stable employment. And for the football program, we work with more than 4,000 kids across Cambodia. We work with boys, girls, intellectual disability, blind wheelchair and uh, also HIV positive. And community, we work with uh, around 4,000 4, family members. And having seen and interacted with all the children in different communities through these programs, what would you say are the main impacts that you've witnessed? So I, I think what, what I am very proud of, of what we do, uh, we see a lot of children who come from very difficult background, have no confidence, have no education, and they are now full of confidence. They, they are either working or they are in university. So that's very proud of education program. But for the football program, we also see some of our children. So the, the football program is grassroots level, but we have number of our player play in various different professional club and also some other player have been selected to be part of national team from time to time. So that's, that's uh, something that we are very proud of. Now I'd like to move on to Mr. Galliano. Could you tell us how you first became involved with ISF Cambodia? It goes back to 2021 when I was the president of AppCham and we decided to have a uh, CSR committee and look for causes that AppCham can support. Of course, we're a business association but we still wanted to be able to give back. So we, we formed this committee and this was one of the most worthy courses uh, we could find. Uh, we visited a lot of the uh, NGOs and uh, also other charities. And uh, this was one of the chosen ones, uh, given uh, that we saw that the less fortunate children uh, were given an education. Uh, we're also, uh, introduced to sports, which is always helpful, uh, so they're not introduced to other things. Uh, and uh, we really uh, thought it was uh, fabulously run, well managed, and we saw the funds go to very good use. So it was a very much a chosen uh, charity that we thought was appropriate, suitable for us. Uh, and we were glad with the result. It's been amazing. And of course, now you've just been appointed as the brand ambassador for ISF Cambodia. Could you tell us about how this all came about to be and how you're feeling going into it? Well, I, th I think it's been really a, almost a four year uh, process. So we started, as I said, in 21. Uh, we continue to support the uh, organization for two more years. Um, there's been different aspects of it. There's been uh, just direct funding, there's been bicycles, there's charity runs, which is uh, something I should do more often <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, to get better exercise. Uh, and even Cambodian Investment Management, my company itself uh, has supported separately. Um, so we've been involved with the organization almost four years. We are very uh, pleased with the, uh, these organizations, what's really important is the results, how, you're, how the money is used, how the money is spent, and what the uh, consequence and the results are. And we've, we've seen that ISF has been doing a fantastic job with the funds that they receive. And we, we wanted to develop more channels. I, ISF uh, today is funded primarily offshore, Hong Kong being one of the major destinations where uh, money is uh, contributed. Um, there's only been 10% of uh, monies raised domestically. This is a domestic charity, so we wanted to create more avenues uh, of uh, 
where we could uh, increase um, the pot so that we could distribute the pot uh, to a, a wider basic. Yeah. Uh, so we hope to do more than just what we have today. And by having a channel for domestic contributions, which I hope to tap into, so you'll be hearing from me soon, uh, <laughs> that I could use um, our network and also um, really uh, ask uh, a lot of the corporations and the individuals here that have the wallet to want to contribute that to direct some of that money to what's a very worthy cause. It's great to hear. And for Ms. Vicheka as well, is there anything that you are hoping to achieve through this appointment of Mr. Galliano as brand ambassador? So, so I, I think uh, Anthony joined us is one of the big uh, complimenting to, to what we do at ISI. Because to have, to have someone uh, like him to believe in the work that we do to trust us, it's a kind of open up, hopefully, uh, more opportunity for us to reach out to more to more support her. So now I'm very, very happy to have him and looking forward to working with him. Could you let our audience know how they can give to ISF Cambodia? Uh, so yes, so there are a few different ways to, to make donations. It could go through our website or could just do uh, ABA QR code. We also happy to welcome people who would like to come and see the work that we do. And any amount that you make donation would be a big help for us. So we very welcome for any amount. Thank you so much for your time today. It was a pleasure speaking with you both. I really look forward to seeing the appointment as the new brand ambassador go forward and really looking forward to seeing also ISF Cambodia's work continue. Thank you very thank, much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You've been with B2B Cambodia. Thanks for watching. Join us next time as we continue to bring you more news, updates, and developments from the business community in the Kingdom of Cambodia.